Crews are on the scene in Mississauga, where a child has died after being struck by a GO train. Let's go straight to CTV Siobhan Morris, who's live near Cothra in Dundas with the latest. Siobhan. Zoraida, this has been just such a difficult night for this community. We saw members of the victim's family come together to exchange hugs and to cry out in emotional pain about the sudden loss of this child. Now, police say this child was hit by a GO train along the train tracks behind this apartment building around 7.30 tonight. Here's more of what they had to say. Police and emergency services arrived on scene and located a young child that had been struck by a train, at which time they attempted to render assistance to this child. Unfortunately, this child succumbed to their injuries and was pronounced deceased on scene. 12 Division Investigation Bureau, coupled with Metro Lynx and CP Rail, are conducting an investigation into this incident here tonight. We run over right away, and uh, my mechanic called 911 right away. Apparently, seen the body of a kid that's laying beside the tracks. And then, obviously, there was a, a woman that came from a complex directly over here and picked up the body of, of the child and carried the kid with her, screaming. The police haven't been able to share any more information with us tonight about this child, how old they were, their sex at all. Uh, police also weren't able to say if the child was with parents, other family members, other members of the community. We are hearing from some neighbors tonight talking about what they feel is an unsafe situation along those train tracks. There are big gaps along the train tracks where people can walk through. They say it's quite common for people to cut across those tracks as a shortcut to get to, get to Dundas Street. It's something they want now to see change. They want to see a fence put up to add a barrier to prevent this sort of thing from happening again. Reporting live, I'm Siobhan Morris, Zoraida. Back to you.